So, I bought a flat. <laughs> it's crazy. I still can't believe it. Um, so I'm starting this vlog before I've moved in because I'm just gonna kind of take you around what I'm doing pre-move. Um, I got the keys, it's today is Wednesday. I got the keys on Monday and I'm moving Saturday. Um, but I, this is the first day I've had people in to do anything. As you can see, starting, this is the main lounge. Um, starting just to put the whitewash um, color on, the like base color. Let me have a look at what one actually is. It's this Farrow and Ball one. Um, as the base one, um, just to get everything kind of whitewashed before I move in. Because um, I don't not like this color as a color, but for a wall color for me, it's just not quite right. Um, it's just a bit too blue for me. Um, so today I'm just, yeah, we're doing that. So painting before I move in, like then I'm gonna choose actual colors. because like this is too dark for me as well going to choose actual colors um, to then put on top of the white base color. This is the room where we just pulled up the carpet today as well. We being absolutely not me. I watched my brother-in-law kindly do it for me, <laughs> um, which was simple enough. It looked anyway, but I, the floors are pretty good. Um, it's just like a few bits like this, but like I think that can be filled in. I have been given a glove with instructions and this to pull out any staples in there before anything and then i'm going to hoover as well um really fun activities um I honestly like have no that was the painting and pulling out that carpet is the main thing i wanted to do so i'm not going to give you guys like a full tour now i'm kind of more taking you along for the ride with me because do you know what i actually really don't know what the fuck i'm doing um <laughs> It feels really crazy that I bought a flat. Like, I've wanted that for so, so long. Like, I cannot tell you. Um, I mean, I'm sure you guys will understand. It's obviously owning a home is, is has been a goal of mine. And it's crazy that I'm, you know, it's here. It feels surreal. And I thought, you know, the stress of buying and all that. And I was like, oh, it's gonna be so zen when I move in. I mean, it will be. It, I do feel a lot better now. So I'm like, oh my God, I have a never ending to do list, like literally. <laughs> ah! Um, so this is a bedroom. Again, had that dark walls on like random bits. It's so weird, but it's lovely. Um, attic conversion, so good light too. And that's the Eve storage. Um, so just getting those white. This is like the color that was here, which needs a bit of love, but I'm gonna, that's fine as a base coat before I choose like the actual shades for up here. Then there's a little bathroom up here too, um, which is going to be the first bathroom that I redo because you've got this wonderful, well, it's going to blow me out now, but skylight light. Um, perfect for my line of work. So um, I also need to like order a fridge and a washing machine and all these things that I've never ordered before. Um, just kind of just, I've just measured it. So like here's the kitchen. This is where I'm going to put the fridge. So I'm just, I've just measured this. I'm going to try and find one that fits, but I don't know if it will. Things a bit messy, excuse me. It's my work station for today. I shot loads yesterday and now I'm editing and sending jobs off. That's going to be the washing machine. So just having like a look at, a look at those basically. All right, I've popped you in a cupboard. Um, where's my water? Yeah, so I'm gonna order a fridge. I have like, I've made some like lists of rooms of like things I wanna do first and stuff, or like bits I wanna do, and then like the kind of urgent things, which like buying a fridge, because if I move in on Saturday without a fridge, that's not ideal. Washing machine, you could wait a bit. I'm pretty sure you can get them ordered quite quickly, but um, yeah, washing machine. <laughs> isn't quite as urgent as a fridge, but I think I'll hopefully all of them together to arrive the day before I move in. I think that's doable. Um, so yeah, this is my first little entry to take you guys along with me. I'm gonna be like, all the things I'm gonna change. So the main two things I wanna do straight away, well, paint, pull up that carpet, kind of like they're on their way to being done is the upstairs bathroom, which is the attic bathroom, which is like a shower bathroom. And then there's a downstairs bathroom, which has a bar. And I just, I just don't like that bathroom. There's a tile 
in there with a black and white rubber duck on. I, I can't get my head, just one, and it's just watching you in the bath. And I'm pretty sure the people that lived here before wouldn't have kids, so. <laughs> um, but yeah, who knows? No judgment, just not for me. Um, and also this kitchen is like a light blue. I think I might do like a kind of pinky bathroom, I think. Uh, bathroom, oh I lost my brain. Kitchen, but yeah, my brain is just like crazy with like all the things I have to do. Um, but I want like a kind of warmer colour because there's this nice wood here and I love the sink. I'm so happy with some nice things like this. Um, I might do a kind of warm, warm shade of pink rather than just white because the cabinets are kind of, I'll probably paint them, but they're that kind of like lighter colour. So if you guys are still watching because you're into different paint colours and homeware as much as I currently am, then cool. You're going to very much enjoy the next few months. Um, oh, and I created an Instagram for this place and it's already popping off. I've just posted the carpet being taken up, um, which is called the flat upstairs and then a little underscore because the flat upstairs was already taken, but um, it's on my Instagram and stuff. So I'll pop the link below for you as well if you want to follow with like daily updates and bits like that. Beginning to pack, it all feels real, moving tomorrow. So Clockwork sent me these boxes. I've never packed with actual boxes before. Like I've always just like, had like ones i've you know bought stuff in or like used suitcases and stuff and it's so much nicer this is some bubble wrap that i've been saving because i didn't want to just chuck it so everything's just like a bit like this i'm wearing the most unacceptable outfit so we're not going to be looking at me right now um but yeah it's so nice to pack when you, when you have actual boxes it's so much easier um and also I'm I'm getting like proper removals with clocks work so I know that I don't have to carry it and normally that's my fear because obviously the boxes in my office are pretty heavy for the product um so yeah crazy last day here from my vanity I just find so many minis I think I'm gonna have to get rid of some because I just have literal I mean hundreds of them and then I'm packing my other bits in here I am just having a few moments to myself as my back is killing I don't think I've even been lifting stuff up I've just been like leaning over things I think like into boxes and stuff. But clocks work came today, clockwork removals and kindly packed up loads of this room, which has been amazing. My shelf looks so bare now, it's sad. Um, and then they're coming back tomorrow to finish off and that's when I actually move. Hello. Um, yeah, last night here, crazy. Hello, moving day attire. All the boxes. So just got to the new place. These guys pulling in now, got a spot outside, have ordered a giant pizza because I'm so hungry. Um, so yeah, this is empty for now. I'm just so excited to see it. Oh my god, I look so pale. Um, <laughs> with all my stuff in. Um, we did the walls a little bit before I moved in. It's not really picking up, but they're still a little bit blue. Kind of see there a bit more. We're just doing the base coat and then got my Farinball consultation, colour consultation next week. So then like they can advise me which off-white shade is best, you know, on the light and all my other things in the room. Um, so yes, gonna eat some pizza now and see the house fill up, which is gonna be really exciting. Ordered the biggest pizza. Um, yeah, so I will check in on, I'm guessing, once the stuff in the house. Way is so tiny that they had to take the door off, <laughs> which is really clever, so that they could get more things in. Getting there. So 
starting to look more like my lounge. I just can't with this light blue, but um, that will be going in a couple of weeks. Trying to make sure that I feel, or remind myself rather to feel very grateful that I have this home, rather than thinking about just all the things that I need to do to it, which is a lot, but fun stuff. Yeah. There is a, there is a terrifying amount of boxes in the office. Kind of shove so much stuff in here because I'm not really sure where I'm going to put a lot of things. So, yeah, it's a bit daunting to kind of tackle, but I'm sure I'll make it work. So, first morning here, getting there, I've kind of set up the living room. It feels very homey. I hate the colour of the walls because we put the base coat on, so it's like a light blue. Um, but that's because it was on the dark blue and we're going to be painting it hopefully in the next couple of weeks to a kind of beigey white. But yeah, it feels a lot more like my place. Um, so I'm not really going to bother like putting all the stuff that I normally have on the shelves because I'm just going to take it off when we paint it. And I haven't put the rug down yet, which wasn't really on purpose, but now I'm like, I kind of love because the flooring is so beautiful here. Um, so maybe I'll use it in the office for now, which needs a floor redoing. And there is this wonderful kind of bit from where the fireplace was. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so I want to eventually redo the fireplace, as in dig it out, um, and then have a marble mantelpiece around it. But that's kind of not a job for today, obviously, but the mirror would go on top. That would be the plan, um, just to kind of really open it up. So crazy to have a, a man like a fireplace and not have. Obviously, you can't actually use a chimney in London, um, but um, I think it would just look really nice and just have it like some bricks and then like some candles or books and stuff in there would be really sweet. The office is like storage central um, because it's obviously not a room that I need to use lots yet. <laughs> um, but I just put my curtains on at the back and it just already looks so much. Nicer, let me brighten that up. Um, yeah, I'm gonna finally put that on a wall rather than having it hanging as well. This, my beauty cupboard fits really well here. Um, and this was the floor that needs to be doing, but actually it doesn't look too bad, but it does need like, just to seal it and not be super drafty. Um, but yeah, so this is kind of where I'm hiding the majority of the stuff. To be fair, there's probably loads for the office because um, Obviously, I get lots of packages for work, so, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's a busy room, but I think it's okay here, because then it's almost like I have like, the rest of the house, and I pop a plant here. And it looks really sweet when you come up the first staircase. Ooh, just nearly fell downstairs. Um, take that just looks really homey to me, so I'm really happy with it. For now, for less than 24 hours, I feel good. This is... Um today's task i've basically done the kitchen my fridge is coming in the next couple hours so exciting um yeah i'm gonna try look sometimes because they pack them so well that sometimes some of them just have like um a couple cushions in or something like that so actually can sometimes i can get through them quite quickly and then there's other ones that i'm like nope that is that is not for now i cannot handle that right now um but yeah i'll get there i'll get there um, so it's Sunday, so I'm just also wanting to chill out a bit. Um, this is the kitchen so far. That's where the fridge is going to go, so I need to move these before they bring the fridge in the next hour or so. Um, but it just looks, that was my giant pizza from yesterday, it just already looks a bit more me. But I can't believe I filled up all these cupboards already, because my old kitchen was absolutely tiny. And yeah, I filled up all these, all these cupboards. There's so many. Even this big, like, spicy thing, I filled it up. So, there must have been really good storage in my old kitchen that I didn't appreciate, probably. Um, so yeah, this is my day one check-in. Kai, the wonderful Kai from my Lady Garland just sent me these beautiful flowers. How lucky am I? In between the boxes. <laughs> um, they're so gorgeous. Honestly, I've spoken about her before in my vlogs and she just does there's something about them that just no one else does. So thank you so much, lovely Kai. I'll pop a link to her below as well. 
absolutely fine with this being one of my first deliveries at my new place. I quite like the aesthetic of Chanel box or nose with moving box with as well. Um, can't wait to see what's inside. Yay, the light's coming out to give me an idea of what the light will be like. Looks so much nicer. I don't really like the, the bottom window is like, I don't know what that word is, so that people can't see in, but I'm, I'm high up and there's not really, there's not a house opposite me, so I think I might eventually remove that. Oh, it looks like my place now. <laughs> Yay. Okay, so started in the downstairs bathroom and I do have to say putting stuff in cabinets and you afresh is very satisfying and making sinks look cute makes me happy. I really don't love this bathroom, especially because of this random jug. <laughs> it's just got like black tiles. I've just been cleaning a bit as well, but like definitely looks nicer with some, some little bits in. Um, and the tub actually does look really deep and wide, so I am thankful for that. There's a shower in here too. Um, but yeah, one day I'm gonna put skylight up here. Okay, so this is the shelf, I've just added a plant as well, I think that helps. Hello, I'm a state, <laughs> post moving day state. Been unboxing for a few hours, but yeah, very happy with it. And this is all these boxes still. The clockwork is going to come pick them up kindly because there's quite a few. And then I feel like I'd made a real dent in here. I guess I have, there's way less here but it's just really funny because there's still so many boxes. You just keep unpacking them and the pile kind of stays the same, but that's fine. I don't want to hugely unpack too much more before painting and doing the floor and stuff. So I've kind of gone through all of them to know like if there's anything I need um, for the moment. I do, I want to eventually put that console that was in my office before here, but obviously that's being used as space. Oh, I'm gonna put my rail together upstairs in my bedroom now actually, so I can have my clothes up. I'm so happy with this morning light and it comes the other direction through that window in the afternoons and evenings as well. So it kind of feels like home. Looks more like my place, right? Haven't sorted everything out, but having a big comfy bed certainly helps. I just got out of the shower. Well, I'm out of breath. I just ran upstairs. I'm really unfit. <laughs> Um, so I'm probably going to sign off here because I'm technically moved, but of course I will still be, um, I'll be doing lots of home content. Um, make sure you follow my The Flat Upstairs new Instagram for The Flat. I'll pop it in the description here. And um, thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a lovely day.